Okanagan Sun Coaches Show. It's week eight of the BCFC season. Ryan Waters, head coach Shane Beattie. Coach, let's go back to Langley, the victory, the 31-10 victory. Couldn't have planned the defense and special teams any better, could you? Better, could you? No, sir. I mean, I thought we executed um, the game plan to the T, and um, the kids were just flying around, played physical and played fast, and um, we couldn't execute any better. How many variations do Brandon Van Nistelrooy have in the fake punt? I know you don't want to give too much away, but is there a, a handful of plays, 10 plays? Yeah, we just put in two more this week, and um, so probably six or seven now. Mm -hmm. And he um, he has the liberty to make the call. Um, I give him the green light, and um, he'll make the adjustment. He's a smart kid, and um, boy, he hasn't been wrong too many times this year. How well is the secondary playing right now? Early in the season, it was kind of touch and go, with five interceptions this past week. Yeah, I was, like I said to you earlier a couple weeks ago, I, um, I thought we had a lot of growing to do and improvement to do, and um, the kids are starting to communicate now and um, play very well together, and I, I think we're almost there. Offensively, yeah, you put up 31 points offensively, but the offense didn't seem like they were comfortable against the Rams. No, that's a good defense, um, and that's going to be a battle in two weeks again from, from, from today or tomorrow. Um, but um, they, they they did everything we asked them to do. Cam just missed a couple passes, and when, and we couldn't run the ball. They stacked the box, and um, Langley had a good game plan. Let's look at VI. I, I would imagine they will try to do the same things the Rams try to do. Yeah, they're just not as big up front, um, and they run a different little different defense. They run a three-two with a monster, so. It's a little different. It's not they're not putting seven in the box like Langley did. But once again, VI is really playing well right now. Yeah, is that concerning? Because they are playing so well. Can, can you take instead of concerning? Obviously, it's a bit of concerning because they are playing well. Can you take what you did in Week Four against them, that 64-20 victory, and bring it into this week, Week Eight? Or they have they completely changed and shut that down? No, they're they're running the same style. They're running the same plays. Um, they've changed their punt team a little bit to like ours now. Okay. Um, they've changed some their punt block a little bit, but. They're just executing a lot better right now, and the kids are growing, and um, they're young, so they're getting better every week. It's going to be a very good game. Going down to Nanaimo again, I guess you'd rather not do that? <laughs> no, not at all. It's, it's got to be tough to, to beat a team three times in, in one single season, so how do you get past that? Just getting better every week, and our kids have, whether, regardless of who we play, we just have to get better every week and execute our game plan and um, you know establish our identity, and we didn't do that last week on offense, but this week we're, we're ready to go. Weird that at this point in the season, it's the final road game of the year. Thank God. <laughs> yeah. Coach, thanks a lot. Thank you, sir. Take care. <laughs> Head coach Shane Beattie, the Sun, will take on the VI Raiders week eight of the BCFC season in Nanaimo on Saturday.